Through the good and the bad, there are moments of kindness all around us. So we are starting a very new segment called Kern's Kindness, which features everyday people in our community doing something kind. And 23 ABC's Callan Hobman is joining us with her very first segment, and she's featuring two police officers joining us live right now from the Bakersfield Police Department with more. Good morning, Callan. Yeah, that's right, Tori. Kern's Kindness focuses on your everyday neighbors doing extraordinary things in our community. You may remember the story from a few weeks ago when a Bakersfield police officer responded to a call that took an unexpected turn. You'll also meet an officer who helped a little boy overcome his fears. Take you may have seen this video making its way around social media two weeks ago. Bakersfield police officer Aaron Watkins was responding to a noise complaint. Teenagers were playing music in a park late at night when Watkins decided to join in. I was walking up and I heard one of the kids playing uh, Isn't She Lovely on uh, the guitar. I was like, man, it sounds good. I just kind of felt compelled to just, you know, play with them. Uh, so that's when I grabbed the bass and started to have an impromptu jam session with him. Watkins says he grew up with music. His father plays the guitar, his brother plays the bass, and his mother and sister sing. He says he felt a connection to the teenagers playing together. I knew they were good kids, um, just kind of out there having a good time, playing music and just connecting with each other. And uh, I knew that this is one of the opportunities that I could, you know, seize and connect with them. And so I know it's something that they'll remember for the rest of their lives and it's something that will stand out in my career. Watkins says he hopes moments like these show community members that officers want to connect with them and that they have more in common than they may think. We're human beings outside of this uniform. These officers are, they're human too. They're, they're just like us. They, they like the same things we like. You know, we live in the same communities that you guys live in. It's just really important to, to seize those moments. Now meet Sergio Ortega, who has only been an officer with the Bakersfield Police Department for two months, but has already made an impact after responding to a call about a little boy being bullied. The nine-year-old was afraid when the officers first arrived, but Ortega says they bonded over the boy's Pokemon t-shirt. I started making small talk with him like, hey, you know, I like that shirt you got. Uh, who's your favorite Pokemon? We just started talking for about like 30 minutes about it. I was able to get him to calm down and he was finally able to relax and talk to me. Ortega says he understood how the child was feeling. For me, it was amazing because I know as a kid myself, I, didn't, really, I didn't, didn't feel like I had that connection with law enforcement officers. So I feel like we were able to connect and he was like, oh, okay, I can, this guy's my friend. I can talk to him. And the little boy gave Ortega a Pokemon card of his own. I made a promise. I'm going to keep this card with me right here in my, in my pocket. As long as I'm a police officer, it goes with me every day. When I go on duty, I keep it here just to keep me safe. You know, I, I made a promise to the little kid and I'm going to keep that promise forever. Now he's working to return the favor. We're trying to get uh, donations uh, for this kid. So whatever donation, donations we get, we're going to try to get contact the little boy and give him donations and give him all the Pokemon cards we can get him. We're always looking for the next person to feature in Kern's Kindness. If you have someone in mind, feel free to email us your idea. For now here in downtown Bakersfield, Callum Hallman, 23BC, connecting you.